you very much for accepting CGTN's interview. As an international M&A lawyer, what's your biggest headache for your client right now? As we know, the current China-U.S. relations brings lots of uncertainty to business, and the conflicting law make Hong Kong operations more difficult than before. Uh, I think that the biggest uh, headache is we have a lot of clients, um, as you mentioned, who are caught uh, between the conflict laws between China and the uh, United States. Uh, when I say uh, the conflict laws, uh, which means um, the, the opposite effect of laws which imposed by China and the United States. So which means uh, there is a risk of one company, if a, a company uh, uh, complying with one law has the risk of uh, breaking uh, the other country's law. So that is the biggest headache for multinationals. Um, they are caught in the middle and it's almost impossible for them to uh, pick up a side um, because um, China and the United States are very big market. Uh, simply for many, com many companies, um, they are the number one, number two market for them so it's a bit like the situation that um, a husband caught between a wife and a mom if they cannot get along with each other. So it's a very difficult situation for a lot of multinationals. Or do you think they have better choices to avoid those conflicting laws? Well, there, there are uh, short-term solutions and long-term solutions. Um, I think short-term solution is that uh, they need to um, uh, be more sophisticated in terms of a compliance program with uh, the laws in China and the e United States. Um, for example, they need to localize the compliance. Um, they cannot have one compliance program, one size fit all for the whole company. Um, it's not black white and they need to structure the business carefully and also in terms of business intake, they need to be careful what sort of business they want to take. So there are structures and the way in which can minimize the risk, but nevertheless, uh, you can't reduce the risk to zero. Um, but I think the long-term solution is that multinational companies should um, discuss the difficulties and um, uh, the, the, the situation they are facing, uh, especially with the U.S. government and the policymaker, and uh, to, um, to frankly lobby them to uh, have less confrontational um, policy uh, with China. Thank you very much, Peter. Thank you for your time.